We have a passing to note. We all know that iconic photo celebrating America's victory over Japan, the end to World War II. Well, tonight, that sailor in the passionate kiss with the nurse, a stranger in Times Square, the man who insisted always he was that sailor, has died at the age of 86. And here's ABC's John Donvan. How jubilant was the taste of victory? Everything was magic that day. World War II had just ended that afternoon, and wandering about in the euphoria of New York City, Life magazine's Alfred Eisenstadt got this picture. And it was magic. Sailor smacks one on the kisser of a dame who's a nurse. While around them, fuzzy, out of focus, everyone smiles. The same smile you just had on your face. The photo bookended an era, but it also launched an argument. Who was that guy? Many candidates stepped forward, but best believed of them all was this man, Glenn McDuffie, who died just this week at the age of 86, who always said it was him that he climbed up from the subway to join the crowd. A lady, when I come up out of the subway, a lady met me at the top of the steps and said, Sailor, I'm so happy for you. I said, for what? She said, the war's over, you can go home. And he expressed his joy. In fact, experts who have looked closely, matched his ears and his musculature, agree. It was McDuffie's moment, and he was lost in it. His head turned away, his identity, hers, their secret. Which made the magic, because unknown, they were everybody. John Donvan, ABC News, Washington.